So Vectors Biosystems was uh, founded on the insight by uh, our CTO, Dr. Karen Duggan, into the role of a peptide that's in all our bodies and uh, the fact that it was not just, a, when it was depleted, it was not just a marker of disease, it was in fact a regulator of disease. We then formed Vec Vectus Biosystems with the support of a lot of doctors and uh, people who took a great leap of faith in the early days as a biotech company. And we located ourselves in CSIRO in North Ryde. And so we had the flexibility of a entrepreneurial biotech company with the resources of CSIRO, which enabled us to do the drug modeling and the various tests and scale up that we did. And uh, the uh, journey has been one of um, continual discovery. And I think what's really um, important is we had Ivan Rekovic, our patent attorney, embedded through the whole process of discovery and not trying to work with our uh, intellectual property after the event. Vectus Biosystems uh, addresses some of the greatest and most um, challenging disease states in the world today. So um, its for core proposition is not just the slowing down of disease progression, it's actually aimed at reversing end organ damage. People that are on dialysis can cost $100,000 a year to the community. So across the range of um, heart disease, kidney disease, liver disease and pulmonary disease that we're targeting, these are some of the largest franchises in the world today. And again, we're not aware of any other company that has successfully targeted reversal of end organ damage as opposed to management of the disease process. Therefore, we are um, first in class from a reimbursement point of view and we have uh, the capability to have not a single compound because fundamental to Vectus's uh, platform is that we have a drug library of over 70, um, 70 compounds. So we really do have a very, very significant commercial opportunity. So the um, cardiovascular market uh, in, the, in its various uh, manifestations would be um, in excess of $100 billion. Now, these large numbers uh, reflect the size of the therapeutic market. But even in a licensing environment which we contemplate, the returns uh, to our shareholders uh, could be very significant if we pass through the stages of uh, human clinical trials, supported by the very strong data we've got to date. Uh, we have examples of recently in Australia, uh, Fibrotech uh, being um, acquired for around 600 million Australian and several other companies much higher um, outcomes than that. So uh, we believe that uh, our commercial opportunity uh, would rank us with some of the uh, more significant biotech companies in the world today. The ASX uh, is a not only a milestone for Vectus, but it's important in a number of ways. It is classically true that the pharmaceutical e industry expects pioneering biotech companies to run out of money. And as a listed company, your finances are visible but your supportive shareholders certainly place you in a position where that's not going to be a consideration. Secondly, um, we are able as a listed company to look at the world in terms of staff to develop our platforms and, and our insights and our previous experience with listed companies support that where it's been a very, very strong driver of the company's growth, the cash aside. And lastly, um, as a listed company, it gives us the ability, as our science progresses, to have a dialogue with our shareholders and potentially pursue several opportunities in parallel rather than sequentially. Now that Vectus uh, has uh, completed a successful IPO, uh, we are actively uh, developing the lead drug uh, and manufacturing it under pharmaceutical standards. 
Uh, that is a big milestone for any company and we're very, very confident of uh, scaling the drug and, and that should be uh, happening uh, over the next couple of quarters. Subsequent to that, there's some additional testing we do and then we are already in advanced discussions about our human trials in Victoria where uh, we'll be doing phase one trials uh, confirming safety and phase 2A trials looking at the uh, efficacy of the, uh, of the drug or early efficacy of the drug. Um, what's really interesting is if we look at the pharmaceutical industry today, the large companies have a relatively poor pipeline and they're looking to the innovative biotech companies for new opportunities and in our case uh, if we look at the range of transactions that's happened in our field, they're starting to happen between the point we're at now and these early trials. That's where the scattergram shows the majority of transactions are happening. So um, we believe there'll be very significant interest in our work. We're very excited to uh, have our listing uh, this morning here at the ASX. The buzz in the room is palpable. Uh, our team uh, are even more charged and we really look forward to uh, this next 12 months uh, where uh, Vectus Biosystems will uh, enter the world stage and uh, we're now uh, proudly uh, joining the ranks of great Australian companies that made an impact.